Hello dear students welcome to Allen Overseas I hope all of you have given your best in JEE advanced exam do you know what is the further process after appearing in this exam how to get admission in IITs in NITs in triple ITs and in other GFTIs here the JOSA comes in the picture JOSA as the name clears joint seat allocation authorities which allots the seat in various technical institutes based on the choice filled by the students and based on the cutoff issued by the institute side today in this video we will be knowing about the overall process of josa counseling session and the important dates and deadlines of counseling session 2022 so this is the official website of josa josa.nic.in from there the candidate has to register themselves by providing their je mains application number and password after that choice filling portal will open in the portal you will have to provide your choices in the decreasing order in which college on which seat you want to study you will have to provide the preference according to your choices this is called choice filling portal after that there will be two mock seat allocation round this year there will be two rounds of mock seat allocation if you get any college or any seat allotted under mock seat allocation round you will have to log that choice and you will have to give your acceptance against that seat after that seat acceptance option is there for seat acceptance you will have to pay the seat acceptance fee that is called online reporting so for seat acceptance fee you will have to pay 15000 rupees inr if you are coming from sc st and pwd category and 35000 rupees inr if you are coming from rest of other categories so seat acceptance fee option says fee payment and document upload process for documents you will be required to upload your 10th class certificate for your birth proof if you do not have that certificate at that moment you can provide your birth certificate as well your 12th class certificate for state of eligibility proof your category certificate if you are coming from a particular category you will have to provide that category certificate josa authority has issued the prescribed format of category certificate also and the final document is medical certificate it is applicable for all the prescribed format for medical certificate has also been issued by josa authority after that query response option is there if the documents uploaded by your side are not in the proper manner or are not in the proper format the verification officer the verification authority will raise a query against the document uploaded by you and you will have to respond that query by providing the document in the correct manner or by providing the correct document the last option is freeze float and slide what is this option these are the willing option if you want to accept the seat which has been allotted to you under any round you will have to give the freeze willing option the float option says if you get any seat allotment under any college and if you want to upgrade your choice if you want to upgrade your branch or seat intra colleges the float option is there and if you get any seat allotment under any round and if you want to upgrade your seat within that same institute or within that same college you will have to give the slide option acceptance so these are the overall process of josa counseling session in the further process we will be knowing about schedule of events of josa 2022 from 12th september registration and choice filling portal will open as you know that je advanced result will be announced on 11th of september so from 11th you will be having ample time to provide your choice preferences and the deadline is 21st september so from 12 to 21st september you will have enough time to give the choices between these dates 18 september and 20th september are the dates for mock seat allocation 1 and mock seat allocation 2 this is schedule in brief of different rounds 23rd september round 1st 28th september round 2 3rd october round 3 8th october round 4 12th october round 5 and 16th october is the last round which is round 6 date so dear students this is round 1st from 23rd september at 10 am morning seat allocation round 1 will open and 27 september is the last day to respond that query within these dates 
from 23rd to 26th September, the online reporting process which we discussed before, fee payment, document upload and response by the candidate, these process can be done between 23rd to 26th September. Round 2 will open on 28th September at 5 p.m. Dear students, if you get any seat allotment in round 1, so at every round after paying the seat acceptance fee, it will ask you to provide the willing option which is freeze, float and slide. As I have explained you these options, after paying the seat acceptance fee under next round, round 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, if you get any allotment or if you want to give your willingness, it will ask you to provide freeze, float and slide option. So 28th September round 2 will start and up to 2nd of October you can withdraw your seat or exit from the process. If you want to withdraw your seat, if you want to exit from this process and if you want to withdraw your query, you can do by 5 pm of 2nd of October. Between these dates 28 to 28 September to 1st October online reporting process can be done and 2nd October by 5 pm last day to respond to the query. Round 3 will start from 3rd October and from 5th to 7th October you can seat withdrawal, exit from process and withdrawal query response can be done and 7th October is the last day to respond to query. Round 4 will start from 8th of October and 8th to 11th October is the seat withdrawal, query responses and exit from process can be done by 5 pm of 11th of October. Fifth round, it is an important round. This is the last round for seat withdrawal and exit option. Dear students, fifth round will start from 12th October at 5 pm, seat allocation round 5. This round says that if you get any allotment under different different rounds of JOSA and if you want to withdraw that seat, you can do it under round 5 and this is the last round means this is the last round for seat withdrawal for IIT colleges, yes. After that, there will be no further round for seat allocation in IIT colleges. Yes, for NIT plus system, there will be another round also. But this is the last round for seat withdrawal. 12th October, it will open and 12th to 15th October, you can withdraw the seat, exit from this process and withdraw your query responses. Round 6, which is the final round of JOSA counseling session. This is the final round for seat allotment of IIT colleges. 16th October at 8 p.m. Round 6 of seat allotment will, al will open 16th October to 17th October by 8 pm you can do the online reporting by paying the fee by uploading the document and by providing the query responses 17th October is the last day to respond to query and final round for IIT colleges after this there will be further round for NIT plus system what is NIT plus system dear students those institute which provides admission purely based on your J main ranks are called NIT plus system. So after round 6, there will be further round. It will open on 16th October. Initiation of withdrawal of seat. If you want to withdraw your seat in NIT plus system, you can do it by 5 p.m. of 18th of October. And 19th October to 21st October are the dates to pay the PAF, which is partial admission fee. If you get any allotment in NIT plus system, you can pay your admission fees and you can accept your seat. After that, there will be further round which is CSAB, which is Central Seat Allocation Board. If you want to take a gap, if you want to go for CSAB process, the further process can be done by the official website of csab.nic.in. Dear students, this is the overall process and the schedule of JOSA counseling session 2022. After that, the colleges, the institutes, will start taking admission based on the online reporting by the candidate side. Do not worry, all of these students, those get seat allotment through JOSA, those get seat allotment through CSAB. Their admission process will be done all together on the same time and their classes will also start on the same time. Do not worry, we are here with you. We will be coming with more videos about the explanation of further stages of college seat allotment and the choice filling. From entire LN overseas, we wish that all of you get your desired seat, your desired branch in a reputed institute, in a reputed college. So from LN overseas, we wish you all the best. Thank you.